Of continuing the countdown for the launch window to the Artemis One mission. The launch will bring a new era in American space exploration. Our Taisha Walker is live at Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral with the latest on the mission. Taisha, good morning. Lisa, good morning to you. We know that the countdown clock has not moved in more than 20 minutes, which will likely mean uh, that this uh, launch may not happen this morning. We want to show you video of what the launch pad looks like right now. You can see that rocket still sitting there. We are told that the launch director is discussing the plans with the hydrogen team right now. We know that there were other issues this morning, including a possible crack in the core stage, a fuel leak and an engine bleed. Uh, this hold right now of the countdown clock is just shrinking that launch window, that two hour launch window. I'm going to to Kathy Hernandez, who is at the Johnson Space Center at a watch party. Kathy, what's the sentiment right there? Good morning to you. Yes, it may not go on. A lot of people, though, here still excited, waving their flags, ready to go. And if it can, in case it does happen, they're going to be watching that big screen there. Also, people have plenty of opportunities and activities, including giveaways and also chances to take some photos with some pretty awesome characters here. People can also enjoy the Artemis exhibit right here that that exhibit opened up this summer and also they can look and and get some more information on the Orion prototype type here and guess what I showed you last time but I'm going to show you again they have moon pies for everybody here also authorities not authorities officials leaders here they tell us they will plan another watch party if the launch has to take place on a different day guys back to you we get it people yep. in charge breakfast the champions and there's moon pies let's do That's it all we need to know Kathy <laughs> thank you